Right, hello! Welcome back to Will and Jim. Today I asked Edda and Jamie to go out and find the cringiest TV show he possibly could. Something that would really hurt our soul. And he came back with King of the Nerds. Ooh. I was actually going to come into this video saying I was the new king of the Will and E channel, so I guess that makes me the king of the nerds. Oh, because you all love him so much. Oh, he tells funny jokes. Yeah, well, I'm really jealous now. I am the people's champion. <laughs> Do you want to just take this from here since you're the boss around here? I've never had so many positive comments in my life. I've got myself a boba tea to celebrate. Don't ruin it now. They will call you a- Really? Why? What's wrong with boba tea? Okay, uh, the show features nerds and geeks with diverse backgrounds and interests competing in various challenges for a cash prize of a hundred grand. Very exciting premise. I hope it's good and it's not a stinker. Also, I hope you all like my new hoodie that I was mentioning to James yesterday. I bought without reading and it says, fuck now, suffer later. See, when I saw this, I thought it meant have sex now. It does. That's what it means, right? No, because it means fuck now. Fuck the now. I thought it makes me look like I've got HIV or something. <laughs> I got in the lift yesterday and someone laughed at me, so I'm now only wearing it exclusively in my bedroom and to the millions or hundreds of thousands of people, depending on how this goes, watching at home. A project for the science fair this weekend. King of the nerds! Now, a new fellowship. Oh my god. Oh yes! <laughs> 11. <laughs> this is like Raven for adults. Of the brainiest. Can I overpower some capacitors yeah. and make it? Where is the oh. Linux machine? <laughs> gaming. Oh. Gaming. One of the first words. Fantasy and science fiction lovingest nerds in the world. I'm actually inside Tron. Look at the trim. <laughs> what is that? The Enterprise would beat the Millennium Falcon. The Falcon can fly circles around the Enterprise, especially when the latter is diverting all power to shield. Wait, 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 wait. Was one of the judges the guy from Star Wars? I thought it was the great Carly. <laughs> they will compete in games of knowledge and skill. Imagine calculating relativity while flying on a broomstick. Do you really think you can beat me in a LARPing and gaming challenge? That's me to you! What's a LARPing challenge? Like, should we define LARPing? Live action role playing! <laughs> I'll never need to define that ever again. What a word. Only one can be king of the nerds. I'm on board. I am so oh. on board. That's probably the best announcer they could find for this show. I love how they can't, for copyright issues, they have to make every character slightly different. Did you see the Pikachu ripoff? Fuck <laughs> 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 is that? <laughs> Pikachu's been stomped on a few times. I'm Zachary Stork. I'm one of the top 25 World of Warcraft gamers on the planet. Top 25 on the planet? That's nuts. Wow, bow down, fellas! Being a nerd is like a way of life because the greatest people throughout all of history, the greatest people were nerds. Is that true? I, I think no. Short people, short people are the bane of this earth. I don't mean to be heightest. You will be competing for $100,000 and the right to be crowned king of the nerd. <laughs> $100,000 is a life-changing- Pokemon oh, Master! Oh, on. That is the title you want. They're the ones have like fantasy writer, mechanical engineer, <laughs> Pokemon Master? Well, I guess if you go professional, if you're like a professional gamer, you could be a Pokemon Master. But then again, if you were professional at like COD, you wouldn't be a lieutenant. You know what I mean? The first Team captain is Zachary. Awesome. Victory for Sylvanas! He's going to be a handful. The second team captain is Chris. Yes. I'm Chris Jackson and <laughs> mm, we should have intros like that. <laughs> yeah, should we do it for this? I will be king of the nerds because I represent the engineering community. You can't make an enterprise without engineers. You can't do teleportation without engineers. You can't make a lightsaber without engineers. Yeah, they all just seem like kind of dorks. He's an actual like scientist. So I don't know if it really counts. But he has very unrealistic expectations for what engineers actually do. If he thinks like, oh, I'm going into mechanical engineering. I'm going to make a lightsaber. I'm going to be a Jedi. Look, fella, just cause you couldn't hack a STEM subject at uni, don't get salty now. <laughs> It's 50 grand. You now have two hours to explore Nirvana and get to know each other's strengths and weaknesses. Let the nerd war of wits come Oh my god. Oh my god, it's Celeste. Go, 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 Celeste.
opening the door and looking at Nirvana. It- Who do you reckon that is? Is that Mike Wazowski? <laughs> He's had a hard fucking night if it's Mike Wazowski. <laughs> a rough paper round. <laughs> See, this looks good, mate. This looks pretty good. They got a snooker. I don't know. Do many nerds play snooker? Crossword! I am so psyched to see all the swords that I can pick up and just, like, be the power of the warrior. <laughs> oh, God. Where did they find him? Star Trek or Star Wars? There's no one can compare. Yes, you can. <laughs> My name's Kayla. I have a master's degree in space studies. Rocket scientist. You're telling me we're putting Pokemon Rust there and rocket scientist on the same level. <laughs> I can't tell if that guy looks more like Harry Potter or Bilbo Baggins. Star Trek is about exploration and my dream, my goal, my passion is to send humans to Mars. Actual functioning human. What do you mean actual functioning human? She's a rocket scientist. She's got a job. She's got normal aspirations. Like she's just here because she's got funky pink hair. Can we talk about this idea of sending humans to Mars and that being your dream? Have you seen pictures of Mars, right? It looks cool. But once you see a couple of meters of Mars, you pretty much get the general gist of Mars. It's just a big orange rock. Depends who you're sending there, really, doesn't it? Prisoners. The, the, the French. Why did I look at the calculator first? My name is Jack, and I study medicine. Oh, hello! Bio engineer. Everyone here is a genius. I'm introverted, but I have been known to rap. Make them girls go loco when they see me bust a move on the periodic table. It ain't easy. Jack, what they done to you, fella? But if you want to learn it, then repeat after me. Hydrogen, helium, lithium, beryllium, boron, oh. carbon, carbon. Oh. Uh, yeah, sorry. Oh, yeah, but you get the gist. I do. I get the gist. Poor Jack. I have nothing but respect for it. Actually, I won a contest by NASA to pick their greatest fan, and I was that winner. <laughs> yeah, anyone can be a fan. Anyone can be a fan of NASA. Yeah, I wanted to work for NASA. Right, yeah. I wanted to be a translator for NASA. Uh, and th- th- that's going well, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's actually going fantastic. <laughs> Everybody is such an expert. <laughs> yeah, Gamer. so number one. <laughs> Gamer, that's the best thing you can say about yourself. Some people know me as Jay Wits on the internet. I'm a Pokemon oh, master. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Josh. I run a Pokemon centered YouTube channel. He's a YouTuber. He's got a million well, subs. He's not a nerd. That means you're cool. I don't know. Top 10 worst Pokeballs. For catching the opposite gender. <laughs> That's so cursed. The worst Pokeballs, the one that catches the opposite gender. <laughs> I'd like to take back my support for the Pokemon Master. Thank you very much. No Pokemon at one point became not cool. I just never stopped caring. Nice to meet you all. Well in, well in. I like him. I like him. Well, he was ahead of the curve. Yeah, I bet he's worth a fucking mint now. God, I don't know how to follow that. I'm Nicole. I got my bachelor's degree in chemistry. What was that post? What was she doing there? Is everything all right, Nicole? <laughs> Inorganic chemist. Inorganic? Inorganic. So not organic. I think it's to do with carbon chains. <laughs> Where did I come from? I'm probably the resident like Uber music nerd here. <laughs> This sounds like me. Wait, did she say she was a drummer as well? I've been drum major for God knows how long. Yeah. So maybe she's like, in chemistry, she's like cooking up some fatty beats and that's why it's so, it's such an in- inorganic banger. You know what I mean? You've given him too much confidence. Since the last fucking video, you've given- Oh nerds, to the throne room. Jesus Christ. That is the worst looking throne I've ever seen. It's like Bruce Wayne's Hall of Armor. Fucking Limp Biscuit walk through the door. And the right to sit atop the throne of games. <laughs> That's such a bad throne. Oh my God. The throne of games, do you get it? Oh, what, like Game of Thrones? Yeah, but backwards. I-, I like this show more and more as it goes. Our team is the Midas. Alright, steady on Power Rangers. There was even a presentation. It's amazing. And <laughs> you can let it go. You can drop the arms down. <laughs> it would be like if you were doing an S2W video and you're just like, I <laughs> just stayed like this the whole time. <laughs> Who's he even snapping at? That's a wall. That's a mirror. There's a mirror right there and he's going. We can have it fun, but I'm not gonna sing. Can you beatbox like the whole the time when we talk you then? It's a science fair. It's not a talent show. Yes, I can beatbox. <laughs> they should have put that as his slogan. That's his fucking talent. That is some of the best beatboxing. I've ever heard. We're spending time today trying to paint a giant banner. I think we're winning. If we just 
Don't forget that we're awesome. Oh, it's criminal. This is criminal. <laughs> Just, it's making my skin crawl. Oh. I am a very, very zen person, and I try to center myself, bring myself down, sort of fall into a meditative state for a moment. <laughs> this is me thinking of my next pun. Mary-Kate and I are working really hard to get these visual elements done, and Zach's taking a nap. What, he's just sleeping? He's team leader. I mean, if he comes up with something with a banger, though, if the song's sick. Well, he's asleep. Sack him. <laughs> no, okay. Wait, 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 what did you- Sack, sack him. No, okay. Bro. <laughs> Hello, my name is Will By, the alchemy guy. <laughs> and I am here to- <laughs> He doesn't want to be in that room. He's like, they need to be paying me more for this. Our crowning moment is throwing in the one ring. Be very careful about this. Um, ready? Oh, that's very nice. Been I haven't seen a ring that explosive since after the Vindaloo I ate last week. <sighs> they were so much screwed up with our presentation. You just slept all day. <sighs> I hurt my thumb. He's gone. He's so gone. The fourth vote. Oh my god, he's gone. He's mudded. Zach. <laughs> Zach, you will be going to the nerd off. <laughs> the producers are like, can you, can you say something, please? I'm going into this nerd off today. I'm going to defeat whoever is in there. And then I'm going to vote myself to the next one and defeat the next person again. I am through with everything. That was pretty fucking badass. Oh my God, he's quite scary, isn't he? Gonna go a deadlock the whole time. I'm just gonna piss the lot. Josh, you will be going into the nerd off. This is great. The least intelligent member of my team is Josh. He has similar gamer skills to me, but- Similar gamer skills? That's an important metric, Will. You are a redundancy in our programming because I know every Pokemon you know, plus. I have an IQ of 146. I can absorb the world as I see it. He's got such good attitude, man. I did everything. They just completed my vision. Completed his vision? All right, Scarlet Witch. Sorry, that was a nerdy joke. I'm really, really glad I'm on this team. <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> oh, 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 my oh, 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 let's get a replay on that. <laughs> oh my. This blind-ended tube averages about 11 centimeters in length. Kind of sexy. Oh! Oh, that was close. Come on, Josh. But by a hair. Feels like a, a time mage has actually used stop on everything in the entire world and we are now in a temporal bubble. There is so much easier ways of saying that. Realistically, time has stopped. Three words. Zach! You have won this point? No. Today, I did something for the first time in my life I've always wanted to do, which is show a group of people who did not appreciate my abilities that I have abilities and that my abilities are superior to their abilities. Oh my God. You may rejoin your team. Oh God, look at him. Mate, this is like a super villain formation arc. This is unbelievable. Can we have one last beatbox? Come on, do Come it. On. Come on. Oh, my. Oh, we can't send him home. Oh, oh but blah, 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 miss you. <laughs> oh. Bye, Josh. I don't like seeing people go. Especially people who are good people. He's not dead. Well, you've tons to make a paper mache volcano together. This week is all about... Well, well, hang on, what's my man in? What have they done to you, Dave? Live action, yeah. role playing, oh! and gaming! LARP it up! If you put on a costume and said that you're a character, you've LARPed. LARPing sounds like sucking dick. You know what I mean? LARP, LARP, LARP. You know what I mean? Oh God. I know, but I'm not trying something something crazy. I've got most of my costume done. I need to start. I'm not having fun. If, if you push on. me away Hold from on. this team, I will not be a member of it. Hold I will on. drive us into the ground and systematically Zach. destroy each and every one of you. Ooh! Oh my God. Systematically. Have you seen The Incredibles? Uh, yeah. This is Syndrome. Careful. Oh God. 
We're here to finally put an end to the oppressive Adam Sono government. I am Magnus, and my blade shall taste your flesh. Take this, and another, and another. He's lost it. He's fucking lost yeah. it. Yeah. Please join us in the throne room. What does the guy in the, the presenter on the left, what does he do? It's emotional support. And the right to sit atop the throne of game. Every time I look at that, it looks worse. <laughs> Zack. We'll be going to the nerd off. I beg he loses. Oh my god, he needs out. Oh, Dang. and they were kicking off. Dang. To the nerd off. We have a disease in the house. Woo! Disease? No chill. For the last round, Midas Touch Attack has chosen Zach as their driver. If you can last more than 33 seconds, you could win this nerd war. I don't think a nerd ever has. <laughs> It's taken me a while, guys, but I managed to get one joke in. How about dodgeball? Oh, no. Well, what did I just do? It's stuck. What the? <gasps> what the hell? Yeah! Hey! <laughs> okay, Zach, it's fine. You did what? the best you could, okay? That's not my best. Don't say I did my best. I'm, I'm a world-class gamer, and I can't believe I just did something that freaking <laughs> pathetic. Oh! <laughs> a world-class gamer. But that doesn't make you an athlete. Yeah, it's high in a ball. How does that, like... Every single time you start talking, you act as if every single word you say is law. It's not. Cut it out. Zack is like a young Anakin Skywalker. What I'm trying to- uh, I'm, I'm not sure if I really see the similarities. Full of emotion and uncontrollable. I don't want to compare Chris to a Sith Lord, but- <laughs> Just shut up, Brian. Just fucking shut up. <laughs> You're a historian! Use historical figures! With the score tied at two, whoever knocks down the next ball will win this nerd off. Oh my god, he's lost it. He's gonna lose. Yeah! Yes! Counts. It counts. Zach, your tale of survival here at Nerdvana has become epic. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. You're underselling it, quite frankly. <laughs> But we anticipate the next chapter, not only of your life, but of the books that you are destined to write. Thank you. What do you reckon the guess is? How many do you reckon he wrote? He's still having a nap at the moment, so we're not quite sure. Zachary. Oh, he wrote a book! Zana. All of the infinite planes, but the home plane are thought to be shattered and lifeless. Do you want me to read all of this? Uh, we'll keep going. Infinitely greater sacrifices have been made before. Do you, do you want the accent? I think we'll probably just sack this bit off. I think in any group, you're going to end up with the outcast. I did become that for this game. He's Andre 3080. What did, you, what did you say? He said there's always got to be an outcast. So what I did was took Andre 3000 and then called him Andre 3080, which is a gaming capture card. So I... <laughs> we just do that bit again. And I must say that what my self is, I think is pretty spectacular. So I, I think I'm a pretty good self. He's just crying. That's me trying to convince myself that I'm not miserable. Oh, there he goes. They just burnt him! That's the end of this episode of Will and Jim. We hope you've enjoyed. As always, please subscribe to James if you haven't already. Like the video, subscribe to me, and we will see you guys later. Goodbye!